Okay, I'll just show you how to set the sat nav in this Fiat Ducato van. Um, so from any screen, if you go onto nav, we've gone onto map there, it's been on map before. So you need to get to the direction. So what you need to do now is press the nav button again. And then you've got navigate to. It's basically a TomTom -tom system. So click navigate to. You've got home, favorites, address, recent destination. So we'll go to address. And we're Grosvenor Garage, Chorley Road, Waltonydale, Preston, and it says city and postcode there, so we're going to put our postcode in, which is P, well, R. Now we need numbers. You've got one, two, three down here, so we click one, two, three, and it's changed to numbers. We want five, four, and then we need to go back to letters, so that's the A, B, C there, J, where's S? All right, I can't see S. Not like I've not done this before. So that's it. Papa Romeo 5, Poor Juliet Sierra. Just click on that. It's asking me for a house number. Uh, we don't have a, a number here, but I put 272 in and then click done. House number found, not found, nearest available, so done. Turn left. That's it. That's how you, uh, that's how you um, set the sat nav. Okay, I'll just show you how to delete a mobile from the Bluetooth audio system in this 2019 Fiat Ducato van. So from any screen, if we go to phone here, go to phone, you've got no phone connected at the moment. You've got settings down here, so we'll click settings and you see Barry's iPhone. Connect or delete the device, I want to delete it. Delete Barry's iPhone 11 from phone and audio device list. Yes. That's it gone. Really, really so simple. Good system. Okay, I'll just show you how to pair a mobile to the Bluetooth audio system in this 2019 Fiat Ducato. Um, first of all, we make sure Bluetooth is on. So click Bluetooth on there. And then we watch. I, I have got rather a lot of things connected to my phone, but... Um, we just we're looking out at the bottom here and then we go to phone click phone no phone connected pair of phone yes it's giving me a pin number there but i, I don't think we're going to need it so we'll just wait to see if it comes here we go you connect that's it so we want you connect there click on that does your device display pin Yes, it does. So pair, it gives you an automatic pair uh, pairing code if you do it this way. Contacts and favourites, do you want them to sync? I don't because I, I won't be using the van again. Um, thanks Spider Lifestyle for posting just as I'm doing this video. <laughs> pairing successful, make this your favourite. Do you want to download your phone book and recent calls? No, I don't. But that's it. So that's, as you can see, that's connected. In order to stream audio from this system, what you need to do is go to your iTunes there. I'm going to turn this down, but you see there you connect at the bottom. If you click on that, there's a tick next to you connect. If there's not, just, just touch it. Uh, we'll go back to there. So with that showing, if you're on the right setting on the radio, whatever's on your phone will play through the audio system here. Now we go to media, Hunter Media. And it's come up with my phone already, showing the same thing playing on there as it is on here. So I'll, I'll turn this up. It won't play anything because this is turned down. But I'll just also show you. If you go to source, if it's not immediately on Bluetooth, it, perhaps you, you've got USB stick in. But if it's not on Bluetooth, you click source, select Bluetooth like so. Now then, so we're turned up here. And then, if I, I can't do it for very long, otherwise I'll, I'll get a copyright infringement, but... That's it. Not the hoople. That's how you do it. It's a great system. Thanks for watching.